Hi, my name is Gary Anderson. I first got involved in Formula One in 1973, working for Bernie Eccleston. I came over from Ireland in 1972, and um, through one thing or another, I met up with this young lady in Swanley in Kent, and um, her brother worked for the motor racing stables at Brands Hatch. So I went to work there, got a job as a mechanic, and uh, one night we were sitting talking, and for some reason, through the motor racing fraternity around Brands Hatch, we had heard that Brabham were looking for some mechanics just to build Formula 3 cars and she wrote a letter to, uh, to Bernie Eccleston to, or to the Brabham team looking to see if they wanted any mechanics and I got a letter back from a guy called Colin Seeley who used to build the Seeley motorcycle. Uh, he was managing director of Brabham at the time to say no there wasn't any vacancies and the next day I got a letter back from Bernie Eccleston to say yes there was so um, I took Bernie's letter, went to the interview and I got a job building Formula 3 cars. I worked there for a while building Formula 3 cars and say for Brabham, which was owned by Bernie Eccleston. And um, he came to me one day and he said, oh, would you be interested in coming on the Formula 1 team? And I said, yeah. He said, well, I've got this DFE engine here, weighs 135 kilograms. If you can put it in the back of that transit van, the job's yours. So being a, a good, strong Irish boy, I uh, lifted the back of this engine into the back of this transit van and I got a job in the Formula 1 team. Bernie was very honest, hard, wanted the job done correctly. He didn't take uh, no as an answer. When he wanted something done, he wanted it done. But with that honest, he didn't, you know, he never would back out of something. He never leave you in carrying the can for anything. He was there for you as well as pushing you to do the best you could. 1973, Formula One was a very different uh, discipline to what it is in 2017. And um, I have to say, Bernie's one of the people that took it there. So it was nice to know him before it happened. And I also know him quite well now. And it's nice to know him after it happened. And he, he's done a fantastic job for a lot of people.